and of the potential cover-up here at the university. Live in State College, Jim Melwort, KYW News Radio. And stay with KYW News Radio for more on the Penn State story coming up in sports, along uh, including a look at what happens next in the Penn State football program. KYW News Time, 737. The only thing better than getting what you wished for is getting more than you wished for. Announcing the Lincoln Wishlist event. Get the season's most attractive offers and four years of complimentary maintenance on the Lincoln MKZ that's got all the luxury trimmings at no extra cost. Like intuitive sink technology, standard. Leather seating services and real wood trim, standard. Heated and cooled front seats, standard. Plus, MKZ was ranked most dependable entry premium car for the second year in a row, according to J.D. Power Associates. And with a great offer and four years of complimentary maintenance, it's perfectly decorated for the holidays. The Lincoln Wishlist event, where you'll get more than you wished for. Find out more at Lincoln.com. Coverage includes a maximum of eight early scheduled maintenance services. See deal for qualifications and complete details. For J.D. Power Associates award information, AccuWeather is up next. Do you want to seriously cut the cost of your wireless bill? Metro PCS can show you how. Get ready for this. Four unlimited lines nationwide talk, text, and web for a hundred bucks. Four lines, one hundred dollars. Unlimited talk, text, and web with taxes and fees included. So it's a hundred bucks exactly for four people to be unlimited. Month after unlimited month. And nobody signs an annual contract. All you folks out there that are spending sure. Now's the time to come to Metro. And just to make things even more interesting, you can get a full featured no contract phone for as little as nine dollars after mail-in rebate this is an opportunity to save thousands of dollars on your wireless bill and hundreds on a new phone four unlimited lines a hundred dollars only at metro pcs hello 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 wireless for all limited time offer restrictions apply promotional plans include all features forty dollar monthly service often not available with all rate plans or all handsets rate services and features subject to change metro pcs service for personal use only see store metropcs.com for details coverage handsets in terms of conditions of service the jam you could have avoided. Traffic and transit on the twos means updates every 10 minutes at 2, 12, 22, 32, 42, and 52 after every hour, 7 days a week. KYW News Radio 1060 every day. KYW News Time 739. And now the AccuWeather forecast is sponsored by Mid Atlantic Waterproofing. We're going to see some water today, but not all that much. And joining us live is Elliot Abrams. Just a spotty shower or two, Ed, and a lot of fog this morning. The fog will disperse. The afternoon temperature getting just to 60 or a little higher. Chilling off to the 40s tonight. Tomorrow, a dry day. Partly sunny afternoon temperatures mostly in the 40s to low 50s. Then a recovery to the 50s and then 60 this weekend. I'm AccuWeather Meteorologist Elliot Abrams reporting live on KYW News Radio. All right, thanks, Elliot. KYW News Time, 740. A uh, big name in the tech world is a main draw at a forum at Rutgers University next week for those who might want to follow in its footsteps. KYW's Ian Bush explained. Apple co-founder Steve Wozniak is the featured speaker at Rutgers Entrepreneurship Day on Monday. He and Steve Jobs started uh, Apple in their garage. They basically met in a homegrown computer club and the computer evolved from there. Rick Mamone heads up new ventures at Rutgers. He says the free event is for entrepreneurs who want to start new companies in the area or to improve existing ones. They can meet investors to get capital, uh, lawyers, accountants, people who can help them grow their companies. Mamone calls all startups one way to recover from the economic mess. Details on how to sign up for the forum at cbsphilly.com. Ian Bush, KYW News Radio. KYW News Time, 741. A challenging economy makes for good opportunities. If you're considering a new career or a business of your own, take the first step at the Northeast Franchise and Business Expo. If you're ready to take your current business to the next level, start by attending the Northeast Franchise and Business Expo Friday and Saturday, November 18th and 19th at the Romana Philadelphia Air Learn about many business opportunities available to you. Speak directly with representatives from dozens of the nation's leading franchises looking to open or expand in the area. Educational seminars will help you find a franchise opportunity to fit the lifestyle and earnings you desire. Meet experts, including coaches, attorneys, accountants, insurance and benefits providers. And it's all free. Your career, your terms. Franchise Source Brands International presents the Northeast Franchise and Business Expo Friday and Saturday, November 18th and 19th at Ramada Philadelphia Airport. It's free if you register now at phillyexpo2011.com. That's phillyexpo2011.com. Hey, News Time. 
742. Your good hands traffic on the twos is sponsored by Allstate. Here's Sam with that update. Uh, uh, right, Ed, and we uh, have an update now on that Pennsylvania Turnpike problem. It's a westbound direction. We are now jammed approaching uh, the Ben Salem interchange. It's just west of the interchange. Two left lanes are closed with a couple cars and a tractor trailer involved in an accident. State police just got up to the scene. It's taking some time to get through this mess. We understand there is some foggy conditions in this area. Whether or not that actually caused the accident we is yet to be determined. But in the meantime, you need to know that if you're west on the PA, the PA Turnpike, um, and want to go west, I would not get on at the uh, Ben Salem interchange at this point, and that'll be our all-state good hands route of the day, which would be continuing south or, or on Route 1 uh, to get on the turnpike someplace else. We'll keep you posted. All right, we'll get to go out to Chester County. Some more problems here. Uh, north on 202 jammed, approaching 30 bypass, so approaching 401 Fraser. Accident up ahead. That's partly in the left lane. Continues slow even past the accident up to Great Valley. Southbound also heavy on 202 at the Great Valley interchange. Uh, normal condition, but head Still on for everybody as the haze and fog scattered around. Skugel's backed up at 202, then 476 to Belmont, Montgomery to Spring Garden Street, west on University of the South, and then from Montgomery on out to Gladwin, leaving the city limits. South on 95, pretty hard hit, jammed approaching Academy, right on down to, to Girard Avenue, and uh, south of that, okay, northbound to the Comet of Barry Bridge. There's lots and lots of volume everywhere here. Uh, also on City Avenue, City and Bryn Mawr, lights out, northbound City of 54th, broken down vehicle there in the right lane. That is jamming up. Mass Transit. Uh, the Market Frankfurt L is still out of service between 52nd and 15th Street because of police activity uh, with shuttle buses in place. Additionally, subway service trolleys are being diverted to 40th and Market, where, again, you will get a shuttle bus. Another update coming up in less than 10 minutes. Then, Clippy Community Radio, 24-hour traffic center. Call Allstate now to get a free lifetime membership in Good Hands Roadside Assistance. Plus, get a quote and your first tow is free. That's a free membership just for calling and a free tow just for quoting. Shop less, get more. Make one call to an Allstate agent. Find one near you at Allstate.com. KYW News Time, 744. No, you can't buy happiness, but you can definitely buy fun. Laugh and party and sorry officer, we'll turn it down fun. Only at Bob and Ron's Worldwide Stereo and www.stereo.com. Think about it. What's around your house? Dirt. Throwing stuff, what dirt do? It retains water like a sponge. Then, when there's too much water to absorb, boom, it's Flood City, baby. See, rain, melting snow, or underground springs build off dampness and water pressure against foundations and under floors. The more water, the more pressure. And the more likely you are to get a basement full of water. Want to keep your basement and crawl spaces dry? Call Mid-Atlantic Waterproofing. Yeah, that Mid-Atlantic. The guy is so good, you saw them on ABC's Extreme Makeover Home Edition. The guy's patent-pending hydro track solution guarantees to get and keep basements dry. Plus, the cost of waterproofing your basement now is just a drop in the bucket compared to what a flooded basement will cost you later on. So, to get and keep your basement dry, call now. 800 Mid Atlantic. That's 800 643 2852. Now and for a limited time, get a free sump pump with any new installation. Call 1 800 Mid Atlantic for details. Some restrictions apply. The KYW anchored with a forecast some fog for a while this morning, and it is thick out there. Otherwise, variably cloudy and mild today. A couple of showers in the high 60. Clouds break tonight, breezy, low near 40. Windy tomorrow and much cooler with some sunshine, the high 51. Saturday, sunny 56. Sunday, partly cloudy, becoming mild again, the high near 60. Monday, a couple of showers possible, and the high a mild 64. Right now, 54 and foggy on Independence Mall, going up to 60. <laughs> You give us 22 minutes, we'll give you the world. This is KYW, the news center on your radio dial, online at cbsphilly.com and on the CBS Philly app for iPhone and Android. Good morning, along with Ed Abrams, I'm Brandon Brooks. Lauren Lipton's at the editor's desk. In the news at this hour, our top story, also our top story in KYW Sports. It's 746. Here's that. Sports is sponsored by Steinmart. After nearly 46 seasons and 409 wins, Joe Paterno is not going to leave on his terms. The Board of Trustees fired Paterno and University President Graham Spanier last night. Fallout from the Jerry Sandusky child sex scandal. Matt Millen played for Joe Bob back in the 70s. A sad day, obviously. I think it's a sad day for college. I think it's a sad day for football, period.
One of the current players, Drew Astorino, a safety, said this yesterday after a Thierry Paterno told the team of his intent to step down after the season. We have no control of anything that happens with anything at this point, nor do we have any control uh, at the beginning. So I think we're just going to roll with the punches, and you know whatever comes our way right now, we just have to, we have to take it in stride and move on. Saturday against Nebraska, we'll see if this team can put aside the distractions and play football under interim coach Tom Bradley when Nebraska comes to town. After that, well, the rumor mill has former Florida coach Urban Meyer as the prime candidate, especially since he has a daughter attending the university. But there are others, including former Penn State assistant and Temple coach Al Golden, who was never informed of Miami's NCAA troubles when he was hired to coach the Hurricanes. Many think that could be an escape clause for him there. Temple, by the way, is now bowl eligible after a 24-21 win over Miami of Ohio last night. Here's KYW's Ed Bankin. Temple's 24-21 victory over Miami of Ohio snapped a two-game losing streak. Head coach Steve Adazio said he was impressed with how his team found a way to win after overcoming some early obstacles. And at some point uh, in every season, there are those games where you have to find a way to win those games like that. Uh, down players and everything.
Whiteville. Fog is so thick right now that you can't even see the traffic lights from a distance. God. Wow, can't see anything.